Welcome everyone, for the very first time in my entire life I had to use a user manual to understand how some tech works. Now if you look at my setup, you can tell that I'm a tech guy, right? I know how to use Android inside out, I know how to use iOS inside out, I know all the new features and all the new software updates, I know how to use all the new iPhones, all the new Android, so I make tutorials on that stuff, right? And I know how to use Bluetooth headphones, excluding this one right here, the LG Tone. I have never had to use a user manual in my entire life. And the reason why is because even if I don't know how to do something, usually the manufacturer makes it pretty darn easy to figure out. However, look at this, look, look at this, look at this. This, I unironically had to open up. I think I had to open it up to all the way here to like, what, page nine, just to figure out how to use these dumb earphones. So what is wrong with them? Well, the pairing, because I, I can't really show the pairing process because it will stop the recording because I'm using an Android. However, um, usually if you have any normal Bluetooth headphones, there's usually a pairing button. So let's say for example, on the AirPods Pro at the very back, there's this white button. You just hold it down and then there'll be an LED at the front here. The, that LED goes white and then you just go into the Bluetooth settings and then connect. However, with the LGs, they uh, they thought, you know what, man? Screw the pairing button. We're going to make some stupid way that no one could figure out without looking at the user manual, right? So, first of all, they just, they add, they have this weird toggle here. So, I thought this toggle initially was pairing mode on and, like, pairing mode off. Uh, it turns out that uh, this switch here actually switches it so that the, um, the audio will come off of the USB cable instead of your Bluetooth device, which honestly, this feature is incredible. Don't think for a second I'm saying this is a bad feature. It is honestly a great feature. However, I thought this was the pairing, like I was literally, I was pressing this button down because it's the only button on the LG. What you actually need to do is you need to open up the lid, step one, and then you need to hold down either the left or right earbud for five seconds to put the uh, the, the headphones into pairing mode. Who thought that was a good idea? I'm sorry, it is the most unintuitive uh, idea in the entire world. It makes absolutely no sense. And I couldn't figure out it on my own. I actually had to use the user manual and the user manual kind of expects you to be using this on an Android. But oh wait, you know, I have a MacBook Pro. How am I meant to pair it to that dummy little, you know, I was honestly, when I first bought these, I was going to return them. Um, but these AirPods are so good. They are so good. Honestly, if you're thinking, should I get them? The only annoying part is the pairing, but once you get past the pairing, these are definitely, uh, by far the best, um, uh, wireless earphones I've ever used. They destroy the AirPods Pro in sound quality. The actual noise cancellation isn't as good. Just going to keep it real. It's not very good actually at all. And the transparency mode or ambient mode isn't as good either. But the actual audio quality which comes out of these uh, these buds is incredible. I do like the uh, the UV. Even though it doesn't really like in real world it doesn't do anything. But it's pretty cool to see. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel good I'm not putting some dirty stuff in my ears. And um, yeah, that's it. So thanks for watching. Oh my god, see you guys later. This has really pissed me off because I, I just never, I've never in my entire life had to look up. I ne I've never chosen to use my own in my entire life and this is the first time ever. So yeah, bye.